Hulk smash! Puny god. Hepatitis. <laughs> Welcome back to Mishmash Monday, and today we are trying and ranking MREs. Just in case you get lost in the woods, locked in the basement, or locked in the cupboard under the stairs. We have six different MREs here that we're gonna rank from best to worst, so you guys know what to have as a backup in a scary situation. So if you are new here, hit that subscribe button down below to become a part of the Mishmash Mafia, and if you like the video, smash that thumbs up button. Let's jump into it! All right, so we're gonna open them up here just so you guys know. I'll let you do the honors, open right. up like prom night. Oh boy. So basically everything you need is in here minus the water. Whoop. So what one is this? This is oh. chili and macaroni. Oh, it comes with Skittles? Yeah, and uh, apparently some stool softeners for to help you after, maybe? Get <laughs> out of here. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Smoked turkey nuggets. Is this a non-cook? Oh wait, it comes with the heating thing. Oh, we got grape drink? <laughs> we got him a couple of grape sodas. A couple of grape sodas. Should we put you down for a bucket of extra crispy and a couple of grape sodas? <laughs> it gives you matches? Yo. Yo, this is dangerous. Coffee. Nice. Freeze dried coffee. Wow, they give you everything, huh? Oh, this is a meal. It's a meal ready to eat. It's a Mr. E. <laughs> Mr. E. Nigma. Mr. E. Nigma. Edward Nigma. Creamer. Sugar and a moist towelette. Sugar um, on the table. Nope. Salt. Oh, <laughs> so super. Oh. Salt bay. Salt bay. All right, so we have fire that we're just gonna. Yep. Just for the, the fun of that. So we're gonna open all these up <laughs> and do this. You guys got the glimpse of what it is. We'll let you know if there's anything different in there, but we're gonna heat them all up. We're gonna grab some water, basically put it in here with the heating element, close it, cook it, and eat it. All right, so we got them all cooking here. They're basically done. We'll start from this side because that's gonna be the most done. So we have six meals. We got three here. Yep, down here we have chili and macaroni, Southwest style beef and black beans with sauce, and Mexican style chicken stew. And then we got chili with beans, cheese tortellini and tomato sauce, and chicken egg noodles and vegetables in sauce. These are sodium bombs. Each one is about <laughs> 800. Uh, milligrams of sodium per pouch of just the main meal. Now they all have sides. It's a full package on how we're gonna rate it. All right, let's start with the main meal. All right, we got, it's weird they don't have, none of them have forks. You figured they would at least give you a spork. Fork you! That smells pretty good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you know that. What is this one? This, this is, is the chili and macaroni. Oh, well, yeah, of course. It's hot. Oh, it's it does heated. smell good. There we go. Here, now you guys can get a look. It's, uh, it's diarrhea in a pouch. <laughs> That's what it is. Oh, now, yeah, now let's eat it. Yep. All right. Chili macaroni? Looks like goulash. It kind of does, but it smells like chili. It does. Cheers. That's really good. I was expecting a very Chef Boyardee-ish. That bite wasn't very hot. No. <laughs> but, no, the but package was, was hot. <laughs> yeah, but it was still good. Yeah. Now, they say you can eat these things cold. Yeah, you don't have to heat them up, which is better if you do. Yeah. It, it's almost got a Wendy's chili kind of thing. I'm gonna rate that an eight. Yeah, eight and a half. Cause yeah. it's way, it exceeded expectations. All right, so what else came with that one? Cheese spread. Here, we'll try this one. Okay. Find what the cheese spread goes on, cause I think that's the cracker. This is some smoked turkey nuggets. I'm guessing it's like a, whoa. Yeah? It's like a rabbit turd. That does not look like something you should put in your mouth. It looks like something that came out your butt. Oh, there's your nugget. Ooh. That is a legit. <laughs> it looks like a big prune. <laughs> Oh, it smells good though. It smells like turkey. It smells like beef jerky. Like a um, smoky joke. A little hard. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Mm. It's a quality meat, according to this. <laughs> and this one came with cheese spread with jalapenos. So, can you be smarter than a cracker? No, apparently not. <laughs> it sounds like a game show in Harlem. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm done. <laughs> I'm gonna cheese up my forearm. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, cracker's gross. Mm -hmm. Cheese oh. spread's good though. Yeah, cracker's not too bad, as long as you cover it with cheese. I can munch on that though. Sitting by a fire. Mm. Oh yeah. No, that's actually really good. What else came in it? What's in that bag? Pound cake. Marble, cheers. Dry. One of these is screaming. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was something outside and then I hear it, it's going No, you know, all in all for a full meal, that's good. I'm bumping the whole meal. Yep. 
Two and eight and a half. All in all, I was there already. You were. You're staying there? Mm-hmm. All right. All right, so next one up. This is the Southwest style beef, black beans with sauce. The sides are all gonna be the same, so we're not gonna try them again. Ooh, that smells good too. It does. It's definitely got a Mexican, it looks like a... Stop. Yeah, yeah, just eat it. You got some, I'm trying to get a little bit of everything. You got some corn, you got some... Um, beans. Beans, some onions, green onions. Mm-hmm. Um, what is that, chicken? Beef, very greasy looking. Got a little everything? A little everything. Mmm. That one was warm. Mm-hmm. That is good. It's really good. Oh my God. That sauce makes it like a soup, but mm -hmm. I don't know, that's really good. That's excellent. Apple pieces and spiced oh, sauce. Oh, yes. And tortillas, chipotle. Yeah, chipotle tortillas. Yeah. And this one came with a mocha cappuccino instant powder for your drink. We're not gonna drink them. No. Um, here, open that up, because I'm curious about that. Oh uh, yeah, I gotta be careful with this though. Hmm. Soup assistant. Oh, these are the tortillas. Oh. Oh, bring it back! Bring it back! Bring it back! Yo, we didn't know this is a taco! Oh, this made a this made a huge difference. That's my spoon. You ain't getting my spoon. I don't want your spoon. Do you want a spoon? Maybe. Okay. We'll fork. Oh god. Oh getting, god. Getting Cheers. everywhere. Mm-hmm. Mm, oh my god. That ups it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's better than Taco Bell. <laughs> that is a nine. That was definitely a nine. So good. That was excellent. This could be an amazing addition to it though. You already have amazing freaking Mexican style beef tacos. Yep. And then you're gonna add apples and spice sauce? Yep. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. oh this smells like apple pie. Oh apples. yeah, it does. It's just literally the innards of an apple pie. Mm-hmm. Way better than, and it came with the, the cracker and the cheese. Yeah. Um. But that whole combination is a nine and a half. Wow, that close to a 10, huh? Your, those tacos were amazing and that apples just puts it up there? Yeah. All right. All right, so now we got Mexican style chicken stew. This one comes in with a chocolate hazelnut cocoa powder. Again, sounds freaking delicious. Another vegetable cracker. Some more cheese with jalapenos. Ooh, cheddar cheese crackers. That's gonna be cheese. It's right there. All right, so this one I feel like is uh, not. It's got some applesauce, but you'll get it ready. It's applesauce. Oh, but this applesauce is special. So the applesauce is enhanced with maltodextrin for increased performance and your stamina to last four hours or more. Or call your doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Getting these ready too. So this is that Mexican. Oh, steak. they're not oh, cheddar cheese crackers. What would you think? Combos. No, I, well, that's what they are. Yeah. That's not what you thought. No, hell no, that's not what I thought. <laughs> but yeah, it looks like they're, they're combos. All right, cheers, cheers. It's basically exactly the same, but chicken. <clears throat> not as flavorful it. though. That, I think that, well, that was just the tent, sorry. That's all right. I leaked and dripped on you. You did. It's missing something, one of the vegetables or something that was in it. It's got the corn. I think the sauce is exactly the same, but there was that, like the green onions and stuff that were in the other one and the beef. That added, yeah. I think the beef was just yeah. more flavorful. Not as big a fan. No, it's dropping. Combo? Combos. I mean, combos are a 10. It's a combo. Exactly. I was gonna give this a six, but with the combos? Well, um, um, that itself, I'm yeah. giving a six. But. Mm. Mm. It's just a squeeze in your mouth. Hmm. Tastes like applesauce. Yeah. Nothing special, at least throw cinnamon Generic. in there, come on. But, hey, good enough. Oh no, I mean, combo pumped up a little bit, but it's getting a seven. Seven all around. That's fair. We got chili with beans. So we rip, we pull. It's and the, slide. It's the rip and pull method. <laughs> you haven't tried that. Get Here we go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. This is a Wendy's chili all day. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, that's what I expected from the first one. Yeah, this is chili. The I like spicy chili though, if I'm gonna eat chili. So let's let's Fair. test that out. How oh, weird, one half of that bite was cold and the other half was hot. Mm-hmm. That's not bad, there's no spice whatsoever. No, it's very bland. It's like a ragu sauce with some <clears throat> beef. I think it's better than the last one. So and I'm gonna give that I, a seven on its own. Uh, I'm, I think it's comparable. I know six with it. All right, so with this one, you get a tropical punch drink, more vegetable crackers, cheese, cheese spread, cow cake, cornbread, cornbread, and more cheddar cheese crackers. So that's gonna be the combos again. I won't joke, cornbread. So, the fact that it comes with the combos ups it a little bit. The vegetable cracker with the cheese, 
Not terrible. Oh my God, it's soft. It is so soft. Never had Chilean cornbread? I have not. Oh, you gotta try it. Okay. You gotta do it. Cornbread's amazing, and this is very soft cornbread. It's got that little patch on it that's gonna make it soft. Six and a half. All right, <clears throat> cornbread helps. Eh, I like it. I stole a seven for me. Okay. Those bump it up to a seven and a half. With the crackers? The, okay. the combos, and you still get the cheddar cheese with the, the vegetable cracker. You get a lot of food on this one. Yeah. Next one up, cheese tortellini and tomato sauce. Oh yeah, that's Chef Boyardee all the way. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh, it's hot. Chef Boyardee. The sauce is not Chef Boyardee, but the tortellini consistency. Absolutely is. I don't know what's wrong with this one. <laughs> <laughs> you got a special one. That's good. Yeah. I think most of these are gonna give you diarrhea. This one's gonna make you constipated as hell. I'm gonna give that one a seven and a half. Yeah, I like this one better than the last two. Yeah. Comes with nut raisin mix. Open that one up. Comes with a fruit punch drink. It oh, also, it's like trail mix. Yeah. It gives you a vanilla pudding dessert powder so you can make your own pudding too. Nut raisin mix. Okay. There's a lot of nut. The raisins are not good. Neither are the nuts. I threw it up there. Mm -hmm. I've never had a soggy nut until now. Oh, yeah, those are not good nuts. That was horrible. <clears throat> oh, that lowered it. That lowered it down a lot. Open that. I'm really hoping they got some good peanut butter to... That's not a vegetable cracker. That's just a cracker. Just cracker. You have to have good peanut butter if you're gonna put peanut butter in something. It's gonna be like super dry, bland peanut butter. I guarantee it. Oh, yeah. Not bad. The cracker doesn't help. No, I actually think the peanut butter is not terrible. There's that right here. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they're using, but it tastes like the peanut butter that's in the, um, you know those little peanut butter crackers, crackers? you get? Mm -hmm. Not like Ritz Bits, but like no. the, the six pack, like Lance or whatever the brand is, or Austin. That's the kind of peanut butter it is, which is not terrible. No. That's gonna average out to a seven. Yeah, six and a half. <clears throat> All right. All right, so the last one we got is the chicken, egg noodles, and vegetables and sauce. Why do I always have wet fingers? It's kind of more like an Alfredo consistency. Yeah, it is. It's like a Campbell's soup. It's more progressive. Without the broth. Yeah, it's like the, like if you let it sit out for too long and it just condensed. Mm. I really like it. I do too. Oh, too. why? No, it's good. All right, so then we got crackers with peanut butter again. We do have an applesauce with raspberry puree. So they're getting fancy on us up in here with that chicken noodle soup with the soda on the side. Mmm. Mm. You wearing? Mm. No, that's delicious though. That is really, really good. That's good. I don't know, really, really good. Oh, that's really, really good. All right. That's really, really good. And you get some fruit punch with it for the drink. Open the cracker. Cause we got peanut butter again. But that's not all, folks. But wait, there's, there's more. more. We got some apple jelly, y'all. Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. Mix it with the chicken noodle soup with the soda on the side, and you got a hit. <laughs> All right, some apple jelly with the peanut butter. It looks like honey. You can call me honey if you want. I'll call you puree. Oh, you got the tiniest little bit? You were afraid? All right, that's a weird combo. Why would they put that together? Because They didn't, you did. You, you're not just gonna eat apple jelly. Why not? You gotta put it on something. Corn syrup, high fructose corn syrup. That's the two top ingredients with apple juice. This was bomb.com. Yeah, it was. That was an eight and a half by itself. Yup. The rest, I don't think takes away or adds to it. Now the crackers are meh. This, I like the applesauce with the raspberry puree. What did I just say this was? An eight and, eight and a half. half. I'm leaving it at an eight and a half because of that. I agree. Tacos are the best one by far. I'm still giving that a nine and a half total. That's Damn. almost a perfect meal when you're out and about stuck in your basement with freaking Pennywise coming at you. <laughs> just for fun, two of them did come with Skittles. Oh yeah, we gotta talk about these Skittles that came in here. Um, first of all, this one, this one expired May 2017. These packages just came today. Right. And it does say that each one was packaged. They were packaged in 2019. No, sorry, packaged in 2016. The inspection was in 2019 to make sure everything was safe. Well, I don't know how see. At least these are individual Skittles. This is not safe. To That's eat, a Skittle guys. brick. We're gonna try it though. Okay. For fun. We're gonna try both of these. Oh, what the what? <laughs> what the what? See, at least these are like individual Skittles. Those are hard. I don't even. I'm trying to get this. That's open. a Skittle patty. That was what I was gonna name my daughter. <laughs> Skittle patty. What is that? <laughs> 
I'm just gonna lick it. Fit. <laughs> then it's yours. <laughs> you lick it, you own it. I don't know if that's how life works. I'm just... <laughs> I would own a lot of people at this point. <laughs> Uh, oh, you know what? You're trying it. That's really good because they're so soft. They just got melted together, and that's the sour ones. And they're super soft. They're so good. Mm. They expired two years ago. So I don't know if I want to swallow it, but that one's two and a half years ago. Try the hard ones. Oh, <laughs> did you swallow it? <laughs> I almost threw it right down my throat hole. Those aren't bad at all. Why are they so hard in the package? But they're not in your mouth. The world may never know. Congrats to last week's comment of the week winner. Remember guys, as always, links in the description below to follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Smash that thumbs up button to help us out and click over on the Mishmash Circle to subscribe. Yep, remember your support motivates us to make better content for you guys. So hit that notification bell so you get an alert when that next video posts and click up there for the last video. We will see you next week. Later.